Jesus Christ is the same yesterday, today, and forever. Jesus still heals the sick. Jesus still performs miracles. What you're about to watch are healing testimonies of miracles that took place in Orlando, Florida at an event that we hosted in that region. Now, as you experience this service, the anointing is still flowing. That tangible, manifested touch of the Holy Spirit's power is still flowing. So believe for your healing miracle as you watch the power of the Holy Spirit at work from Orlando, Florida. Worship Him now, church. The healer is here tonight. Making you whole, making you whole, making you whole. Reach out and touch the hem of his garment. Lift your hands and sing it again. Hallelujah. His presence, church. Hallelujah. His presence here tonight. Jesus, we love you, we adore you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Ask him to heal you now. In the name of Jesus, sickness has to go. Miracle working God acting on our behalf tonight. Hallelujah. Lift your hands, receive your healing tonight. Step out in faith. Do what you could not do before. I want you to check your body right now. Start moving, start moving, start moving. If there was a pain in your shoulder, your arm, your leg, your back, start testing for that healing right now. Check for the tumor. Check for the skin disease. Check for the pain. Check your eyes. Check your ears. Miracles have taken place. And as you check in faith, you're going to find that the miracle is done. Lift your voices and sing it again. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus, for your healing touch. Give you the glory. Hallelujah. I'm telling you, 
healing virtue just went through this room. So what I want you to do, I'm not just saying that for fun. Test yourself. I've had so many people say, I didn't test myself because I didn't think it would happen for me. And then as they were leaving and when they got in the car, they found out they were healed. Check your body in faith right now. It's a step of faith. And you're going to find the tumor is gone. You're going to find the skin cleared up. You're going to find your hearing is healed. Your eyes are healed. The pain is gone. God is a miracle working God. Now watch this. If you believe God's power just moved through this room and you, you sense the presence of God, just wave at me like this as we worshiped. Sergio, what happened? Diga, this is Abia. Last week, she injured her knee. She even went to the emergency room. They gave her crutches. She even came in limping today. And how she could describe it is oh, she laid God's hands all over her. T start over. Tell me the story while she lies there. So she came in limping. And as you said, begin to lay hands on yourself and test it out. She laid hands on her knees and she said, I can't explain what I felt. All I knew is after I laid hands, it was gone. That's all she knows. Wow. What did you feel go through you right now? <laughs> this is the real deal here tonight, guys. I'm telling you. This is the real deal here tonight. Isn't this beautiful? It is. Lord, thank you. Let her receive a double portion tonight in Jesus' name. Ruben, what happened? Diga, I have Beth here. Beth had to undergo a C-section six weeks ago. She said ever since then, she had pain all over her body. She hasn't been able to even bend over properly. And she said today, she was noticing that her bones began to feel loose. And she said, I was able to gain motion all over my body now. She said, there's no more pain. That's awesome. So tell me about that moment that God healed you. Um, I just felt, when I was worshiping, I felt like I was just being lifted up completely. Like I was literally the only person in this room. And I was spinning. I was telling the guy I had to open my eyes just to make sure that I was in one spot still. <laughs> just to... I've had those moments. You're, you're, you expect to look around and see the throne room. And so then after you sense the Lord doing this, you check your body and what did you discover? My muscles just feel completely loose. Like this morning when I tried to put my shoes on, it was an extreme task. I could barely bend down just to buckle my shoes. Now I can bend over and touch my toes. My muscles are loose. Like I just feel. There's like light over your head. Like a glory. Lift your hands and see. Lord, let her drink, 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 drink. Diga, I have Judith here who gained complete hearing in her left ear. Wait, 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 said, wait, 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 wait. Say that again. Today, Judith gained her hearing back from her left ear. She has been having this problem for 20 years now. She was struck in her left ear 20 years ago. She said ever since then, the hearing has been muffled. And she said during prayer, she just started noticing out of nowhere, the room just got all loud out of a sudden. She said she now hears properly out of her left ear. Can we give Jesus a mighty hand of praise? Are you serious? Okay, so it's and, and in fact, I stood uh, for the Lord's healing of my sister who has cancer. I, I, I was praying for my sister and, and suddenly... You know, that happens so often where people are praying for other people and in praying for other people, they suddenly experience their own healing miracle. And that's, that's what's happening here. You were just so focused on praying for your sister, and then that healing miracle manifested in you. And so, so tell me, you're, you're worshiping, and then suddenly what? Now the sound is so very, very loud, you know, because normally I hear, I hear it then normal because with my right ear, but my left ear... I, See, I want you to cover your good ear. Cover your... What was your good ear? Hold this. Yes, yes, Jesus is Lord, Jesus is Lord. I am healed, hallelujah. Can we give Jesus a mighty hand of praise? Jesus Christ is the same yesterday, today, and forever. He's our resurrected Lord, and he still heals the sick. 
He still opens the eyes of the blind. He still opens the ears of the deaf because Jesus is alive and well. Now let's believe for your healing. This can very well be your miracle moment. I want you to stretch your hands toward mine and let's believe for the power of the Holy Spirit to begin to flow right now and touch you right in the area of your need. Father, in the name of Jesus, I thank you for the healing power that is now flowing. Lord, we come against sickness and disease in the mighty name of Jesus. We thank you, Father, that you are able to do exceedingly abundantly above all we could ask or even imagine. And I pray, Lord, that as this power is flowing, that you would give your people the faith to receive. We release this healing virtue now in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, you're able to heal sickness and disease of all kinds. For your word declares you forgive all our sins and heal all our diseases. I pray they receive that now. In the name of Jesus, the one and only healer, we give you the glory and the praise for every miracle taking place right now. In the name of Jesus, again we pray. Say it because you believe it. Say amen. Now, if the Lord touched your body and you believe you've been healed, go ahead and leave your testimony in the comment section right now. And if you would like to attend one of these healing services, we host them all around the world. This is one of the main things our ministry does. We host healing services all around the world and they are 100% free to attend. So if you wanna keep up with our ministry calendar, just go to davidhernandezministries.com slash events. Again, 100% free. Jesus did not charge to heal the sick, neither do we. So come and believe for your healing miracle. Also bring your unsaved loved ones because the gospel message of salvation is preached. These services include worship, the word, healing, deliverance, and empowerment. So join us for one of these. Again, davidhernandezministries.com slash events. I hope to see you there. And until next time, remember, nothing is impossible with God. Thank you for watching Encounter TV. Don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell. Also, help us spread the gospel of Jesus Christ in the power of the Holy Spirit. Make a one-time donation or become a monthly supporter by clicking on the donate link now.